Is it possible an avatar fitting room for millions of customers? Find out. Hi. I'm here today to bring you the latest fashion tech news that you need to know. My name is Anina and I'm the CEO of 360 Fashion Network. Before we start, if you want to receive this news roundup regularly then hit that like button and smash that follow as we will be bringing you this news every week to keep you in the know of the top stories we think are important. Alright, first up, Zalando pilots a virtual avatar fitting room for millions of customers. E-commerce giant Zalando is set to introduce a virtual fitting room, allowing customers to see how jeans will fit their personalized online avatar. In an effort to double down on its size and fit the virtual fitting room experience will enhance millions of customers' shopping experiences across 25 of Zalando's markets. Customers can begin by creating a 3D avatar by entering their height, weight, and gender. For a selected range of 22 pairs of jeans, which is one of the most challenging categories in terms of sizing, customers can see how pairs from various brands would fit them. The online fitting features a heat map to indicate where the item sits tight or loose on an avatar. News source, the industry fashion, another piece of news it's that China's moon plans involve 3D printing bricks from lunar soil. China aims to test printing bricks from lunar regolith later this decade in a step towards constructing a permanent base on the moon. The country's Change 8 mission is scheduled to land on the moon around 2028 and will likely include in situ resource utilization tests or use resources found on the lunar surface. Scientists gathered at a conference in Wuhan this week confirmed that they are looking at 3D printing bricks using materials from the lunar surface China Science Daily reported. That 3D printing for space activities has been under consideration and testing for many years with the European Space Agency working opens a new tab on making bricks with lunar regolith simulant, and Airbus set to send a metal 3D printer to the International Space Station. Such capabilities mean that items could be produced or replaced in space, rather than need to be launched from Earth, greatly reducing the cost of exploration. News Source, Space, Next Up Snapchat and Live Nation to launch augmented reality tools for live music festivals. Snapchat's Snap Partner Summit revealed Wednesday that they will be teaming up with Live Nation for a multi year plan to bring custom augmented reality experiences to over a dozen of the world's biggest festivals. The 16 events chosen to get what is essentially a second screen supplemental experience will include Governor's Ball in New York and Lollapalooza in Paris. The new integration with Disguise, a leading live event visualization company will allow SnapR to enhance the live concert experience and allow fans to interact with on-stage augmented reality visual productions through the Snapchat camera. The intent is to make a music festival or a live concert even more immersive. News Source, Yahoo, Another News Wrangler posses up with Jeremy Booth for Wild West Web 3 wearables. Western apparel outfit, Wrangler, has teamed up with renowned artist, Jeremy Booth to launch its latest Web3 wearables. The collaboration also features limited incorporated and proof-of-attendance protocol Pope, both of which will play a role in the yet-to-be-launched outfits. Wrangler is no stranger to Fidgetals having partnered with Limited Incorporated in the past offered physical outfits matched by digital twins. However, this time around this collaboration between the four parties aims to take Web3 integrations to the next level. Limited will add an NFC tag to the Western Art Department denim jacket that will be linked to an NFT. This will serve two purposes, the first is to prove authenticity via blockchain while the other is for collector's sake. News source, NFT pauses, next up. Backhug launches robotic back therapist subscription service in the UK. Backhug launches new subscription service in the UK providing a robot back therapist that can be controlled via smartphone and features new proprietary spine map back tension data technology. Backhug, a smart therapy device, has launched a new subscription service in the UK providing a robot back therapist that can be controlled via smartphone. Backhug's proprietary technology includes the new spine map back tension data technology which helps users see the objective confirmation of its outstanding therapeutic benefits after each session. Backhug's subscription service starts at 89 per month and provides free delivery and unlimited usage in the convenience of subscribers' homes. The device has 26 robotic fingers that can loosen stiff joints in the back, neck, 
and shoulder blades. News source, Absolute Gadget, and that's it for today. If you want to get the full top 10 fashion tech news items of the week check out our new podcast 360 Fashion or go to 360fashion.net slash podcast or search for it on your favorite podcast platform. Don't forget to subscribe so that you won't miss our latest episode.